Hey guys, today I'm gonna be showing you how to download mods on uh, Minecraft. All you have to do really is you just have to download Twitch. And I'll show you the steps, of course. You have to download mods for Minecraft. It involves Twitch. You have to download it. I'll have all links in the description. All you have to do is go to at dot net. I mean, not dot net. Dot TV. <coughs> Sorry if I got the but I have like a cool one. But, and then you'll download for this. I'll show you an example. Uh, I already have this downloaded. So you just wait until it downloads. You know, after this, <coughs> it'll obviously pop up. My computer still has a little bit pop up. So I'll just wait until it hits it. I'll probably cut this. Yeah. All right, so it's finally done. It, was, it, took, it take, took really long, sorry about that. But you just wanna hit it. And then it will bring, it will bring up like this. You'll have to sign in or make an account. You should bring it up like this. It will probably bring you to the discover. So what you wanna do, you just wanna go to the mods right here, click on it. And then it will, it will, it will not say like it's already installed for me. It will not say that for you, not unless you already have it installed. But for the new people, it will not say that it's like this. It will say you just hit install, and then it will install it to your main directory. If you do not have Minecraft, it will not work. So make sure you have Minecraft. You want to click on it, and then you'll see that it has mod, my mod packs. This is what you downloaded. And you have browse mod packs, you have browse FTB mod packs. These are just the, all the ones by FTB. And then you can create your own, which I'm not going to be doing. I'm going to be showing you how to do this. You want to find your sky factory. It will automatically bring up like this. Uh, you know, because of how you see it like that disappears or something. See how it disappears? Yeah. And then you'll just type Sky Factory 4, you'll hit it. it, should bring you to this, it should say install right here, it will say install, you just hit install, it will install and you won't even see the installation happen, it will do like, there's not only one mod, like this is all the mods, because sometimes there's like a bunch of mods into this mod. Of course, you got versions. <laughs> These are all the versions that it went through. You know, you have change log, all the fixes and stuff. But you pretty much, after it in does it done, it's done installing. You just want to hit play. It will bring up its own thing on Forge. Like it will have its own Forge Sky Factory for Forge. If it does not say that, and it brings you immediately to Minecraft and there's nothing like this, you might have to redo it or reinstall it. So let's keep that in mind. Uh, just leave a comment down below if there's any issues, and I'll try to fix it with you. But, and then you'll want to hit play. And then it will bring up Minecraft, like any other Minecraft, uh, like that. It will take a while to like load up. Or it might even might be a game from here. Should I show this up? It'll take a long, long time. Mine took like three hours. Or like one hour, something like that. Maybe even 30 minutes, I'm not so sure. But it will show this once this is hit 2869 megabytes. It should be done downloading. This one doesn't take as long as others because this is it's not, isn't as big as others, but you'll see this, you'll pretty much just, you know, wait a little bit. All this will be different though. It will have the same symbol, I'm pretty sure, like this eye. But you can see it's doing all those, like all these are the mods, I'm pretty sure. They'll do that, you know, but I don't necessarily do that though. 
that's how you do it. Make sure you like and subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.